I have been sleeping a lot lately. That's why parts have been getting up sort of late, but in all honesty, that's probably what I should be doing. <laughs> yeah, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Day 5 of Gulf Star. What? <laughs> uh, no, not right now. Let's just play the game. <laughs> so we gotta go over to the soda bar. As, well... Oh, there's a lot of people in chat, right? Oh, get, get, get to speed where I, I'll get my red bandana. There's enough soda in the world. Um, for what? <laughs> uh, hello? Mm -hmm. Go on then. You've recognized me, haven't you? I did? Who are you? <laughs> I'm a catcher. What? Don't, don't, don't tell anybody. What? Sorry, I didn't catch that. I'm a catcher. I... I don't know who this is. I'll give you a clue. Go to where the swans corrugate and seek out the vendor's crevice. It is a simple cache, but we use it to weed out the beginners. So we got a side quest, I suppose. <laughs> swans corrugate. Vendor's crevice. What, what do they mean by vendor's crevice, though? I'll just check out, because I know there's a swan place over, over, over... Like somewhere... Uh, where was that, actually? Uh-oh, <laughs> uh uh-oh, uh -oh, I'm lost, I'm lost! Actually, yeah, I thought it was like somewhere along the left side of the... Well, there's another side quest over there, of course, but... Are you one? This island is too far away. It is impossible to hit it from here. I... I disagree. <laughs> Maybe that's what I'm supposed to be doing here. I'll just give it a shot really quick. Mm, about there, I would say, for maximum rollout safety. What do you have to say about that? That... Guess you were not watching. <laughs> but yeah, I'm not sure what that... That particular side quest means. But wait, wait, what is that? I mean, we're supposed to hit that from the swan area. I mean, he said, he said talked about something with a crevice. I hope he didn't mean like underneath the underwear, but anyway. <laughs> and I'll try going back and hitting that just for kicks here. I suppose that was terrible. <laughs> um. Mm. Mm. Try that this time. Oh, that's a little bit low. Eh, I might still make it. Let's see. Well, uh, I got. I think I got some money from that, but <laughs> I don't think that was a side quest. But yeah, I'm, I don't. I don't quite get it. So I guess I'll come back to that one later too. <clears throat> All right. So other people to talk to. Oop, you. I hit a washing machine on the driving range. Felt great. I felt like it made me a better golfer, even though I hit it by accident. <laughs> Seen that building at the back corner of the course? Yep. And I played there. I heard the guards gossiping. Apparently they're working on a great, sci <laughs> great scientific advances in there. Well, I wouldn't be so sure about that, but I'll give anything to get in. Have you seen that little hole in the front of the building? Uh, yeah, I opened it up. I wonder what it's for. Certainly not people. Yeah, it's for balls. <laughs> Make sure you get enough electrolytes. Yeah, I'll talk to Coach last. I didn't get on so well with the golf. So I'm back selling soda. Wanna buy a soda? Yours for just three fifty four. Um will this like increase my experience level or something? Let's try it. Hmm. Well I got a soda. <laughs> Maybe this is for that other guy that I didn't talk to next to the lake. <laughs> I was wondering when you might show up. Make mine a raspberry soda, please. Oh, I already got it. <laughs> yes, I got you a soda, coach. <laughs> so that's what it's for. Okay. I'm going to be straight with you. As a golfer, your swing offends me. Come on. As long as I get the ball in the hole and the fewest amount of shots, it shouldn't matter to you. But as coach, your results delight. Thank you. Thank you. Perhaps you can win the well run Grow Open through dedication alone. But I thought that event was cancelled. Yes. Unfortunately, the grounds are rather unkempt. The greenskeeper has a lot to answer for. 
<laughs> oh, it's him, Mr. Red Bandana. Ask away! Ah! <clears throat> Sorry. I could be rather straight when I'm hyped up on soda. <laughs> Doesn't matter to me. The real problem is the mole rats. They used to roam happily. Pinch a few balls, pinch a few golfers here and there. <laughs> then one day they changed. Now they move with a purpose. When only I can see it. I have a plan to get to the bottom of it. If you think you could help, come see me tomorrow. We could finally get Red Bandana. Not safe to talk here. What? I'll be there first thing. Oh man, your dedication is promising. Come on, I've got something else to teach you. Yay! You're gonna be automatically transported there? Yes, we will. I'm not just a boring old man. I did know how to have fun back in the day. I call this the hot potato shots. <laughs> oh, coach. Wow! <laughs> that was incredible! Come on, your turn. Hold Y to throw the ball up and press A at the right time to strike it. It takes perfect timing to get a good strike. Let's see if you can stick the green. All right, just give myself a couple stretches here and... Wait, I can't aim myself? Okay. Yeah. Oh, that was terrible. Yeah. Oh, that was terrible. Maybe it's supposed to be at like the height? Yeah. Uh, well... It's a little better. Oh, I got it! I got it! I got it! I got it! Yeah! So it is all about the timing. <laughs> Success! Yeah! Woo! Got paid for my lesson. <laughs> Nicely done. Just promise me you won't use it in competition. Yeah! Something tells me that this is to get balls. Where I couldn't get balls before for some other quest. I'll try my best. I think it's time to call it a night. You have a meeting with the Greenkeeper tomorrow. Sure. Thanks for the lessons, Coach. At least I presume he slept. Yes, he did. But not naked. <laughs> Let's see what's on TV really quick. I said I would check this and I every like every so often. Welcome back to our golf coverage. We're following Laret Minot today here at Lurker Valley. We've got a short part three here. He's got a lot of choices off the tee here. It should be interesting to see how he plays it. She hit a wedge. An interesting choice. And this is one of the longer part of threes on the course. He's left himself with about 180 to cream on a part three. Holy Arceus! His fall off should be interesting. He looks like he should be with the wedge again. <laughs> He's going with the wedge again. He'll never make it! And it's short once again. Oh, how much does he have left now? Sort of just short. Okay. This is quite an interesting green. There's a lot of ways he can play this. Looks like he's going with the wedge again. <laughs> and it's in the hole to go to par. <laughs> he's made. <laughs> well, that's a happy ending. <laughs> An unexpectedly happy ending. As I always said, I should say, as I said before, <laughs> in this in this walkthrough. Don't worry about your other shots. Your next shot may be the greatest shot you've ever hit. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, Greenskeep is probably around... This... this well, may, I don't know. <laughs> Actually, he might be in that shed now. <laughs> For all I know, because remember that that shed had that broken lawnmower or something? Uh, I might actually be too high on the map. Here, nope. <laughs> Greenskeeper! Where are you? Not you. I know you've got a quest for me, but I I'm trying to stay on track here. <laughs> I am writing down, uh, not you either. I'm, I am writing down stuff that, like, I need to go back and check later on, but, but well, but well. Okay, I'll find. Oh, wait a second. Was that. Was I just too low before? I guess I was. Okay, I found them again. <laughs> I'm still getting used to the area. Why won't you grow? Are you okay? Ah, fine. Just mowing and growing. Can I help you? We spoke yesterday about mole rats. I know of no such thing. 
He's trying to keep it secret. We're probably going to go talk in the shed. Be quiet. They have ears. Listen. I have a plan, but you I need to make sure you're capable. Why don't you do a quick lap around the lake so I can see your fitness level? We're going to be running again. Stick to the paths where possible. You'll run faster. All right. 20 seconds. Follow the cart paths. Oh, no. That was awful. <laughs> Why did I go up there when I knew that was the mini golf place? I just kind of, I instantly felt for that trap. Arr, arr. Well, anyway, I probably should just keep going down this way. Wait a second. Am I not hitting checkpoints? Just supposed to go back over to the big. I missed some checkpoints. Uh huh. Not fast enough. Keep training. Yes, I will. Let's try it again. I I don't know how much I can can train, in all honesty, in this game, in terms of my running speed. Yeah, let's go. I obviously was not getting it at all there. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna put some focus here into looking around the parts. Sit around. Okay, I'm supposed to go here then, I guess. Uh, oh, there then, then here, then back here. Okay, I took it. I took a too far wide circle around the southern area of the lake. <laughs> that may just do it. Let's talk inside. They won't be able to hear us in there. Right. Uh oh. I think they heard us. Oh no. Uh oh. This, uh oh. This is not good. Well. Were you followed? Maybe? I'm not sure. No, but a mole rat may have been listening in on our conversation. I figured as much. Quick, give me your golf balls. Wait, do you, n never mind, never mind. I'm, I was, I'm glad, I'm glad you said golf attached to that. I've installed trackers in all the balls. Take them out and hit them to the mole rats who will no doubt steal them. Then we'll track them to their lair. I'm certain we'll find something sinister there. There are five mole rats on the driving range we can track, and there are a few on the second hole. You can get there by taking the path west of the clubhouse. I'll do it right away. Got anything else to say? There are five mole rats. Okay. So we gotta go to the driving range. So there is actually gonna be a real deal side quest with the mole rats after all. You know, the, the ones that I thought that there might be something earlier, but there wasn't. Well, now we're going to be hitting balls to them. Well, tracker balls to them. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm done. Um, wasn't there like one off to that side somewhere? Just really quick. Well, I guess I could hit one to here. This is actually going to be pretty easy to hit to them because I'm landing the ball in the rough, which lowers all my momentum and stuff. Well, okay, okay, I, I underestimated the difficulty. <laughs> All right, let's try it again. And I just realized that astral turf that I'm, I'm on, I landed on my ball here. That's the same texture that's on top of the roof, it's, at least in terms of uh, uh, like just color texture and stuff like that. Not, not the actual way that the ball affects when it hits that, because obviously it was a hard surface when I ah, aha, <laughs> because obviously it hits. A very, very hard surface based on that sound that we heard. Uh, but anyway, anyway. Next mole rats. We go. Here you go. I know you like these balls. Aha. All right. Two out of ten. Uh, I guess I could just fire them away wherever I see fit. Perhaps, maybe. <laughs> I, I presume that there will be a... Uh, is that good enough? Okay. I presume that there is like a, a way to keep... Like the game is keeping track of the individuals. Like you see that the ring turns white when I hit into one of their moly, moly poly holies. Yeah. Yeah. So I can't like hit to the same one twice. Well, anyway, there's said to be five on the driving range. So let's go ahead, and I bet you could just put it up the right corner. Yeah, there we go. Stealing those balls like no one's business. One more. Yeah, I figured it'd be further away. 
And this should do it. Yeah. Ooh. Hey, I can do high sounds again. <laughs> okay. Spy balls planted. So about the other moles though. He said it was on like partially off of hole two. Use hole two. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm looking for, just looking for red rings, of course, but. Uh, what, I just like drop a ball and just hit to where they were at one point? Because I remember there was that one mole that was uh, spying on us over here. So I guess I could plop one over there for kicks. This is not hole two, but. I just kind of want to see if this is what I'm supposed to do because I didn't see any red rings or anything. Nah, I didn't think so. Wait a second, is it? Look, hmm. This is a red thing. Is this something that I could do with my uh, that red bandana side quest? Hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. I want to try and hit that flagpole top, and maybe it'll. Maybe it'll give me a red bandana out of it. Just out of curiosity, because this is a different looking flag than what we've seen here before. Oh. 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 Ah! Yes! So that was the thing we were looking for. You there! How's it going? I got you a bandana. It's more like a golf flag, but... It's it's whatever you use it for. That's what it is. Wow! I'm feeling a lot better now. Yes, side quest completed. <laughs> I'm glad I was suspicious of that seemingly innocent flag there. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. So anyway, am I actually supposed to play around and hit balls to the mole rats or something? I I suppose that's plausible, but. I got maybe I should go talk to the greenskeeper again and see what he has to say. Although, weren't there moles over here too? Uh, well, yes. Let's try hitting to these. Aha! I mean, he's this obviously is not hole two. At least I don't think it's hole two. Maybe it's hole two. <laughs> I've only I've only been really uh, able to play the course once. <laughs> Uh, no, wait, actually, no, technically I played Hole 2 twice, because there was that match. My bad, my bad. But I did only played it in full once, that's what I mean. Haha! -ha. Okay, that, that, that still wouldn't count, because... Well, because, well... I still played Hole number 2 twice, and that goes against what I said. But details! But details. We're hitting balls to moles here. Don't, don't question me. Don't question me. <laughs> Is that good enough? Yes. Yeah, oh, there's one way over by the green. Way, way over there. Why do I keep push, push, putting all oil way over there? Dang it. Um, I should probably just like let the ball roll out, like land it on the green. And let it roll out all the way over to the back side. Yeah. Hello there, mole. Do you like a ball? Yeah, you like balls. So I guess there's one more around here somewhere. Uh, oh, there it is! I'll hit it about there. That looks good. Maybe. Yay! <laughs> Alright. We have infiltrated their holes. Whew. Side quest completed. I don't know if I can do this yet, though. Um, I think I'll come back to that later, because I'm, I'm still trying to... Trying to stay focused on the mole problem. And we're off. And hopefully I'm not going to get lost again. <laughs> oh man, we're getting lost. Oh, there's, oh, oh no, no, there's a pro shop. But, oh, here we go, here we go. Okay. We're, we're good, we're good. I was going about in the right direction. I finished handing out, out the spy balls. I guess it's time to head out. For what? Reconnaissance. Hmm. Oh man, we're solid snaking it. <laughs> this is where the tracking signals lead to. Hmm. Oh no! It's the mole graveyard! Ah, 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 ah. I 
at least I think they're vampires or something like that. I t there are some zombie skeleton thingies there, though. <laughs> this, is, this is getting dark. Oh, stop it. You sound lame. Bring me the eyes, my scandalous miscreants. Eyes. Oh, you don't mean the eyes on the... Remember I, there was those eyeballs hanging around Lurker Valley all over the place? Golf balls are not eyes, though, so maybe they're getting them confused. If you're going to keep talking like that, I'm going home. <laughs> Fine. I think we've got enough now. Let's start bringing our undead armies to life. Rise. I mean, sure, dude, let's do it. <laughs> Wait a minute. These are just golf balls. You were supposed to bring us eyes. <laughs> Our minions can't see without eyes. Don't get so worked up, it's embarrassing. <laughs> Figures there would be something like this. Yes, we all expected a zombie invasion to happen. Does it? <laughs> They've got those mole rats under mind control. We need to put a stop to it before it gets out of hand. It may already be out of hand. I agree with that. Take aim at their minions with your golf balls. <laughs> all right. I'm not great out of mud. Shall we wait for it to stop raining? No time. We need to act now. I have an idea. Attention, Wild War and Base! Requesting emergency intervention! 200 yards yards for the fifth! Send replenishments! <laughs> now we just wait. Alright. Oh, the beverage cart. Sorry it took me so long to find the place, boys. I don't usually come out this far. So, what can I get you? Can I have a sausage roll? <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh, there's, there's no time! An undead army is encroaching on the Wellwood Shore. Um, I don't have enough pies for that. <laughs> you aren't here to sell food. We need your help to defeat the undead army. Of course. Now, what are we gonna do? I have a plan. But the Marshal can never hear of this. Hmm? Hmm? We're gonna hit balls into... <laughs> Okay, uh, I'm gonna actually, I probably prefer to have like a lower, lower angle shot here. Oh, there's no wind whatsoever. Uh, wind, however, I mean the rain, excuse me, might have an effect on my shot, but we'll see. Uh, I'm just gonna kind of pick them off, I guess, try for the middle one first. Mm, oh shoot, that was bad. Or, <laughs> holy jeez! <laughs> Wait, what if I hit those two jokers up there? I might be tempted to do that. If I, uh, am, like, running... If I, if, if I'm doing well, let's just put it that way, I'll, I'm tempted to hit them with, like, one of my spare balls. Alright. Zombie invasion. We're taking care of you right here, right now. That ball did not sink in the water whatsoever. Okay. We can do this. We can do this. How do we get roped up into something like that? Oh, come on! Wait, wait, I hit two there. It bounced off that one and hit the one... The, the, the lower one. Come on. Don't don't be like that game. <laughs> nah, it's fine. They give me a lot of balls to hit these suckers. And here we go. Two, the rightmost one. Which I guess is technically the middle. I hit all three of them that time. Oh, wait, what? I thought I was supposed to kill all six. I wanted to hit you two, dang it! An onslaught of golf balls has felled our army. No, there's two left. My power is fading. Stop being so dramatic. We spent so long getting those minions ready. Yeah, not cool, dude. Come on, let's do something else before we turn into boring golfers. Well, I never. I've been called many things, but never as horrible as boring. Why are the mole rats following us now? They probably released from mind control? Uh oh. Uh oh. Were we just knocked out? Oh boy. Oh, we're okay! And now they have accepted the Greenkeeper as their new leader! <laughs> If you don't want to tell me what really happened, it's fine. And so, what are we doing today? <laughs> Actually, I will be busy with personal matters today. Oh. What will I do then? 
Should I go to the range and see how far I can hit it? That's not really the most useful thing, but I guess you could. Actually, I have some more, some more focus training prepared. Go log into the computer in the clubhouse. Oh, he doesn't know how to use a computer. I've left a video open for you to watch. I want you to study it closely. Ooh, I can learn golf on the computer? Technology has made some advances since I was a child, it seems. Watch and listen to the video as you would me. Uh-oh. So he thinks he can just up and seal my coat with no consequences, eh? Hey? Well then, we shall see about that. Alright. I, th I think that's enough for one part. I'm... That was really out there. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy. And I'll see you in the next part when I go check out the computer in the clubhouse. And see what Coach has in store for us on said video.